I'm happy that we are ready to launch the Digital Academy. This is an important milestone in our effort to accelerate the pace of digitalization in the public sector. To be a smart nation and a digital government, we require all public service officers to be comfortable using digital technology. We also require public service leaders to have sufficient digital skills to lead in the digital transformation. Finally, we require our tech professionals to stay ahead of developments as technology evolves. We need to have the mindset to always improve, even if you feel that you are already at the highest level of proficiency. There are three key design principles behind the Digital Academy. One, it will be a by-practitioner, for-practitioner platform where we can tap on technical experts, both within the public sector and the industry, to design and develop programs that are practical and directly job-related. It will not just be a platform for ICT officers in the public sector to learn, but an opportunity to teach and transfer their skills and know-how to others. After all, as the saying goes, the best way to learn is to teach. Two, the Digital Academy focuses on programs that are at the intersection of technology and the public service. Today, public sector courses on digital technologies covers only the basics and there are few advanced level courses. On the other hand, there are many private ICT training providers that provide quality technical programs but are not contextualised to the public sector ICT operating environment. Digital Academy's unique value proposition is to offer programs that will impart both deep technical skills and understanding of the business of government to ICT practitioners in the public sector, many of whom join us from the private sector. Three, the Digital Academy will be an open platform where we can work with best-in-class industry partners depending on the technical specialisations. These courses are offered in partnership with leading academic institutions and training providers, including NUSISS, who is our operations partner, as well as AWS, Microsoft, Tableau, Secure Code Warrior, just to name a few, as our content partners. There's something for everyone in the Digital Academy. For ICT professionals, you can deepen your digital skills based on the GovTech Technical Competency Framework. Through the programs, you can gain mastery in your job roles, move up the proficiency levels, and build up a network of practitioners in the same domain. For non-tech public sector leaders, the Academy will equip you with the necessary skills to lead and to partner tech teams in delivering the digitalization outcomes in your agencies. For public service officers, the Academy offers opportunities for you to acquire the necessary skills to be more confident in utilizing digital tools in your work. But don't expect to just sit in front of your screen or in a physical classroom. Get ready to be immersed in a variety of learning platforms, from the usual e-learning courses to the more interactive and hands-on sessions, such as hackathons, workshops, learning journeys, mentorships, and even attachments to private sector companies. I encourage all of us to embrace the mindset of being in constant beta, and let's keep learning. The launch of the Digital Academy is timely as we introduce competency-based workforce management across our agencies. I believe the offerings at the Digital Academy will be practical and relevant and will help our workforce bridge these gaps. This will also help them in support of their overall career development in the future. We are currently undergoing our individual competency assessment at GovTech. As the practice lead, I am responsible for reviewing and guiding my team in upscaling to their next level of proficiency. Since the curriculum at the Digital Academy has been developed with the ICT and SS competency framework in mind, it's natural to tap on the programs available. The Digital Academy will become an integral part of your tech career development in public service as the programs span capability development within and across proficiency levels in several domains, thus supporting the continuous professional development. Let me leave you with a question to mull over. How ready to learn will you be if you plan to be extraordinary?